Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Keisha. I blog every day at kjaggers.com. That link is below, just in case you want to visit sometime. So I am back today in my kitchen with another food haul. You know, we've just been doing like little short trips to the grocery store. We haven't been stocking up a lot with the kids not being here for summer and with us traveling. There hasn't been a ton of really big ones. The one I'm about to show you is medium sized, I would say. It's more adult-like there is a few things that definitely some kids would love I think but um, it's really for Scott and I and there's no set time on how long the stuff needs to last I kind of just went off the cuff today and went to the store not prepared I knew I wanted to get meals for a few nights some snacks and I didn't know what meals the only meal that I knew I was going to be making was the um, steak sandwiches and you'll see that in just a minute but that's the only meal I went in with and I came out with like four or five they're not all cooking you know different types of meals like in-depth recipes um i don't want to be in the kitchen that long every night scott's been working till eight nine ten o'clock sometimes so some of the meals need to be things that i can make early and put up and you know that will still be good by the time he gets home some of them um need to be quick meals that i can make once i know he's on his way home um and some of them are just meals that i can plop in a skillet and get going because i don't want to spend a lot of time in the kitchen so um without further ado i'm going to take you through the stuff i got and i'll kind of explain what it's for as we go through it okay so as i said there's no kids in the house it's just scott and i and i got a few more adult things at least things i consider adult like um, but I also got some stuff the kids would probably love. So I didn't go in with a meal plan. I knew I wanted to have ribeye steaks one night for dinner and then the rest was open. So what I did is I found a large ribeye. It was like $13 um, whenever I, I got it out of the deli. And then I just had the meat department slice the steak. I'll show you. It is sliced one ribeye right in half, lengthwise. So one ribeye will feed just Scott and I for a you know, steak sandwich for sure. And um, so I had them do that for me. And then I picked up some King's Hawaiian rolls to go with those ribeyes. Um, so yeah, those will go with that. Now, while I was in the like the fresh meat section, I saw these scallops, oops, they're turned around. I thought they would make a great dinner one night. So I got those and that's for a dinner. And again, that is definitely more adult-like in my house. My kids would want nothing to do with that. Um, I also got, these were on sale and when I was getting some meats that I will share with you in just a minute, the guy behind the counter was telling me about it. It was the Boar's Head Naturally Smoked Bacon and it was buy one, get one free. So I did that and that kind of added either an extra meal, either breakfast with, you know, bacon on the weekend or it adds um, a BLT dinner um, with one of the packages. The other package I can maybe wrap some of the scallops in. I mean, I could get two meals out of this bacon, so I'm good with that. Another meal I got is just a quick throw in your skillet honey chicken by P.F. Chains. I got two and I also got two of their white steamed rice bowls. So, you know, I mean, it's okay to take help every once in a while from the store. Um, again, my husband works a ton of hours and I don't want to spend forever in the kitchen. So sometimes these are very handy. The same with the four cheese ravioli. I thought that I could fry this ravioli like I have before in the past and serve it up with some marinara sauce, maybe some garlic bread if I wanted to. Um, I doubt it though. Um, but that would be another meal. Now, another meal I got was a cheese and meat platter. That's what I'm going to do. And that's where the majority of my money went. So, I got Scott this buttermilk blue cheese. I'm not a fan of blue cheese, but he likes it. I thought I could put some on the cheese platter. But the cheese platter I'm making is going to be kind of small, so I'm going to be able to do that a few times. Um, I bought another President Brie. I love Brie cheese. It's one of my favorites. It's probably my absolute favorite. I bought this prosciutto, um, and it's wrapped in mozzarella. So good to be sliced up and put on like a little tray. I bought some creamy Havarti um, cheese. I got some fresh mozzarella. 
I needed some Parmesan for different things, so I got that, but it's really not for the cheese tray. I got some of the President Authentic Pub Cheese and Sharp Cheddar. It's almost like a whipped cheese, and I got the one in garlic and herb already. I haven't ate it all, so that will also go on the, the tray. Um, Meat-wise, I got one pound of prosciutto for $14. It's a little over a pound. That will go on that meat and cheese tray. It will be delicious. And then I also got... What is it? Rosemary um, herbed ham. I think sun dried tomatoes too. Um, so I got that, and that can go, and also some smoked sausage in case I want to slice up some rounds and put it on that cheese tray. Um, again, the cheese tray could be a few nights because we have so much. Grapes were the same price for red and green, so I just took some of the red out, put some green in, and um, I have grapes in both colors to go with the cheese tray. For that gooey, like, brie, I got some um, nan, and I do have a recipe. I should make it sometime, but this one is the whole grain. Um, just a little bit healthier, so I went with that. Also, for the cheese tray, I also got some flatbread crackers and sea salt and olive oil and some of these Cars cheese melts. They're crispy crackers sprinkled with cheese. Sounds good to me. Then I got Scott some seafood salad. Um, he loves this. Again, that could be at dinner one night. I also got some potato salad because we'll have leftover bushido and different items. So maybe the night he's eating that seafood salad, I can have some bushido and some um, baked potato salad. It's really, really good too. I got a couple green tomatoes for fried green tomatoes. Um, I got a couple avocados. I love the shrimp sauce in, an, in um, Japanese restaurants, so I got some for the scallops. I also got some light mayo. I, sh I will share this in a day in the life vlog. I got some footage um, while I was shopping, but I'm, I don't know. I'm trying to be a little conscious, and I love mayonnaise, so I um, got the light. I also got some of the Yogi Bedtime Tea. I'm running low on nighttime tea, so I needed that. I got Scott and I two of the chocolate satin pies. He loves these. They're little. They're not a whole pie that we're going to sit around and eat by ourselves. So, you know, I kind of reasoned it out that way. I got some more butter. I got a big bag of kiwis. I just think they sounded good. I think they're a healthy snack. I'm going to put them in a bowl and just sit them out, and we can just grab one um, if we want. And even a couple kiwis cut up on the cheese tray might be a very interesting contrast. I got some more tzatziki sauce. I love this. I will have it on my steak sandwich. It is fabulous, um, and it's so good. I got Scott six different yogurts. I got two blueberry, two vanilla, and two strawberry. I saw this fire roasted fresh salsa in the in the um, um, vegetable area, um, in the produce actually, and so I got that to try. And I got some chips to go with it. I got some waffles because we've been needing a few little things for breakfast, but not much. So I got those. You know, kind of in between the days, I have grapefruit. Um, I got some creamy dill mustard to go with that meat and cheese tray. I needed some more Pam, so I got that. Um, let me kind of go around the back. I've only got a couple more things. I got Scott some moose tracks because he loves them, and I got some chocolate milk. Now, we have tons of food in our freezer and our refrigerator. So, again, I don't feel like this is a super big haul, but it is definitely going to last us a while. Um, we'll be eating in the cheese tray. We got the scallops for dinner. We got the steaks for dinner. We got the BLTs for dinner one night. We got breakfast. We got PF chains. We got four cheese ravioli. And, um, again, we can make a dinner or a lunch right out of, like, the seafood salad. And then, for me, some prosciutto and... Um, potato salad so we really are kind of stocked up and that is what I got from the store so did you guys enjoy seeing that haul if you did please give me a thumbs up I know everybody is always like complaining about um, you know not being able to see the number count on the thumbs up I just made that private I explained why a while back um, I just I just wanted it private but I still see the thumbs up so please give them and if you have any questions or comments on anything that you saw or anything in this video at all please leave those below I love talking to you guys I know I've done like three 
hauls this week. Um, today is actually Wednesday. I don't know if I'm going to put it up over the weekend, if I'm going to put it up before then, but whatever day it is, I hope you guys are having a beautiful and blessed day wherever you are, and feel free also to let me know how you're doing in the comments. Um, yeah, I love hearing from you guys. So, again, thank you. Be sure to subscribe if you're new here and you're not subscribed. Just click on my YouTube name. It'll take you to my channel and subscribe. Um, also, follow along on my blog at kjaggers.com just in case, you know, you want to see more. If you want to get to know us more, I've been blogging for years. There's tons of content on um, my blog. And I also have another vlogging channel that was up a few years back. It's got two years of vlogs. Um, they in the life vlogs from our life that I will link below um, just in case you guys want to get to know us better. So thanks again for watching. Bye!